Hey YouTube land, my name's Chris. I run a company called Versus 3D. Um, we are a small 3D printed company, modeling design, uh, based in uh, just outside of Toronto, Ontario. Um, that's Canada, for those of you who don't know. Um, anyway, so I just wanted to do an intro, tell you a little bit about me, and apparently um, Tyrion wanted to be in the video, so he's just kind of chilling back there. He's going to claw me in a second. Um, so anyway, I've been 3D printing for about a year and a half now. I've been modeling for a long time. I stopped for a longer time. Um, a couple things to know about me. First, I vape. I vape all the time. I will be vaping in my videos. In fact, that is what started this company. I will get into that in a second. Um, the other thing is I drink a metric shit ton of coffee, so I will always have a cup of coffee. So anyway. Um, company started about a year and a half ago. Um, my wife and I own another company called uh, Versus Ejuice, which is uh, an Ejuice company, again, based just outside of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Um, and uh, we really wanted to design a really cool uh, stand for a trade show, and we ended up getting one from another company uh, that's now out of business. Um, or closed. I don't want to say out of business because I don't know. Um, but they're no longer a company. Um, and I was I was really unhappy with the quality that we got. And I talked to a few other people and they had ordered from them as well. And they were unhappy with the quality. Hi, Ty. Um, bye, Ty. Um, so I decided I was going to buy a printer and do it myself. And that one printer turned into a bunch of printers because people kept saying, hey, well, you know, can you make me one? Can you make me one? Um, and then the company just took off from there. So we've been in business as Versus 3D for almost a year now. But let me just show you a couple of things that I do. Um, these are actually some new ones. Um, this is... Uh, stand for uh, Forest City Vapes, Canadian Cloud Cartel, their Drizzle Cakes line. This one hasn't even gone to the customer yet. This is Canada eClouds. Uh, just holds 12, I'm oh, sorry, 9 or 10. I don't even know. 10 flavors. Um, in here and then these are all actually led bottom lit so it's actually kind of cool um i'm gonna have to get mine i'll edit this in uh, because the versus eg stand is ginormous so i'll have to move the camera around okay here is the stand that i was going to show you i took the bottles out so this was i think 54 pieces individually printed um, this was all done pretty much on CR-10s, so it's multiple parts, so this is uh, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, um, these are all individual blah blah blah, uh, these are all actually LED lit, except I know I killed the batteries at the show, so there's no batteries in them, so you can't see them lit up, plus it's bright in here anyway, maybe I'll throw a picture of it with them lit up. Um, I couldn't even tell you how many hours it actually took me to print this. Uh, the only thing that's not printed on here is this right here. This is a piece of custom cut acrylic. Um, and then everything else, these are just glued on. So, yeah, so they all uh, match up here. I figured I would just give you a quick shot of the back. So these are all basically just supports, all that good stuff. These are here just to keep the support stable. These are the LED switches. These are all, as you can see, they're hollow on the inside. And I got these little Christmas lights, uh, little strings that go in there and light up. So I don't think any of the batteries actually still work. Oh, these ones do. Uh, anyway, so that was it. So I also do fun stuff. Um, I don't know if anybody, I'm sure you know what a lithopane is, and if you don't, you're about to find out. This is a lithopane from a trip that my family and I took to Disney. 
So, you can get that shot. And sorry, I haven't done the camera on a tripod thing in a long time, so it's going to take me a little time to get used to again. But the cool thing is, if you light it up, you can't see it because that light is super bright. Nope, not happening. I'll insert a picture of it lit up right here. Okay. All right. So, and then other things uh, you could probably see up there a little bit in the corner. That's uh, Illidan from World of Wolf from Warcraft. Uh, up there, I've got a little mule near going on. I have 1,000 benches and XYZ cubes. This is a business card holder for a, the company Cloudheads. I'm giving all these guys advertising. Um, so anyway, there's this. A ton of other things. I just didn't want to grab them all and flood this video because I wanted it to be short-ish. Um, one thing I want to show you. This was... Uh, what actually really, really got me to fall in love with 3D printing. So I am a nerd. I am, and I'm old. I'm almost 50. Okay, I'm 48. Um, close enough. And uh, I was a cartoon fanatic. I love every robot, every transformer, every anything you could think of. But my absolute favorite thing ever is Voltron. I found these models on my mini factory. They're now gone. Uh, I guess the uh, the designer um, kind of moved everything, and he's working on a different system now. And I believe he's doing an updated version of this. But this took me about two and a half months from start to finish, printing, sanding, filing reprinting parts that I broke, redesigning a few pieces that didn't print well or fit well. But this is Voltron. He is fully movable. Articulates like you wouldn't believe. He did an amazing job with these models. Head they all turn, all the joints bend, and it actually does come apart into the five lines. <laughs> it's insane. So these are the kinds of things you can do with 3D printing if you don't know. Um, I really wanna just thank everybody for tuning in. Hopefully you subscribe. Um, down uh, in the thing, in the bottom, in the box there, I have uh, links to our Instagram and our Facebook page. So please subscribe to the channel. Please like the Facebook page. Uh, follow us on Instagram. And uh, I've got a couple of cool things coming up. So I'm going to be doing uh, just a, a simple uh, review of some filament that I just recently found. It's, it's really fantastic. Uh, and it's easily available right here in Canada, online, or if you're in the area where I'm in, it's, uh, I'll tell you, I'll tell you all about it when you watch the video, hopefully. Um, anyway, there's going to be a giveaway involved with that. So stay tuned. Hope you uh, enjoy what I'm doing. Take care.